Eidos. Nah, too late, bro. I am Storm. Legal stuff. Every game sounds best on Sound Blaster 24 bit advanced HD. Chosen by games, loved by gamers. Yeah. Don't you just love advertising before games? I sure don't. Hello and welcome to Thief Deadly Shadows. Um, my suggestion would be um, let's stick just right in and start a new game, discuss everything else later when we don't have a freaking menu in the background, shall we? I got a tip last night from my fence. Heartless Perry. A nobleman named Lord Julian had some sort of quarrel and showed up at a local inn well after nightfall and in a foul mood. He's carrying a velvet bag about the size of a man's fist and it never leaves his sight. Sounds likely to be valuable. But I'll know for sure when I steal it from him. Perry sent over a floor plan of the place, the Blue Heron Inn, Finding his lordship won't be hard. His room number will be in the guest register, if I can get to the front desk to read it. The inn will have guards, but not as many as a private estate. That should make things easy, which is one of the reasons I'm willing to try it without knowing for sure what the take will be. Lord Julian is so protective of that bag. There's got to be something of value in it. Well, we all hope so. Difficulty level, normal, okay. Equipment, water arrows, always useful. Blackjack, never leave home without it. And a dagger, just in case. So, let's start. There we go. It's much better. It's a beautiful night. There's a guard guarding and the crickets cricketing. Yeah. Okay, so once again, hello and welcome to Let's Play Thief Deadly Shadows. This will be my first attempt of an English Let's Play. As you can hear, I'm not a native speaker. So, um, not only will I fail at this game, but at the English language as well. Could be fun to watch. Um, if not, um, you can, I don't know, write an angry letter to Fred of Asgarnia, um, the guy who inspired me to do an English Let's Play. So, um, he's the guy to blame, really. Yeah, what else to say? Yeah, I'm, I'm not really used to speak English, so um, I can read and, and listen to English, no problem, no problem, but, um, well, I didn't practice speaking English, so um, I will stumble, um, words will be missing, and uh, maybe at some point I will rant in a foreign guttural language. Don't be afraid. It's just a foreign language. Um, yeah, what else? Um, I'm not a pro. I'm not gonna be to pretend to be one. Um, so I want to enjoy this game, really. I love the Thief series and um, I really wanna take my time here, you know? Uh, no rushing. Um, I doubt I would be able to rush, though. Um, and I won't take the most serious approach, really. Um, I leave that to the pros, really. If you want to watch that, um, there are a lot of LPs out there with really good players playing this game. Um, Watch them. I'm just whoops. Um, I'm just a normal player who 
want to enjoy some thieving, you know? And um, yeah. let's skip all the talking and do some thieving. And um, we can talk on the way in. I wonder what to do, what to do. Hmm. Let's see. To be a thief, you must learn to use stealth. You don't say. When you hide in shadows, guards will not be able to see you unless they are very close. The light gem at the bottom of the screen, bought here, will tell you how visible you are. Crouching, moving slowly and hiding behind objects can also be helpful but are not always required. In this case, the guard will not see you if you remain in the darkness. Sneak past this guard to proceed. We will do that. You don't see me. Uh -uh. You can't see me. I can see you, but you can uh, see me. Growling away. When's that dinner coming? That's what I want to know. And that's a good question, my man. A good question. Yeah, you should think about that. Real good and real long. Poor bugger. Oh, light. I'm a thief. I live in the shadows. It's a really nice night out here. And the nameless city. I wonder what's next. Some guards will be on patrols. P -p 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 patrols. Looking for intruders. That's me, intruder. You must learn to observe your enemies and use careful timing to slip by them while their backs are turned. Sneak past this patrolling guard without getting caught. What? Without getting caught? Oh no! That's impossible! No, it's not. It's quite easy. We will do this. Piece of cake. No problem, really. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah. Go. Go. Move. There we go. Just follow the footsteps to the shiny blue arrow. Uh, I'm drawn towards it. I'm sorry. I'm being silly. That happens from time to time. Please accept my humble, humble apologies. Yeah, yeah. Ah, he's really good. He's grumbling, you don't hear grumbling very often these days. Good grumbling, that is. No quality grunting and grumbling and ranting. That's uh, one of the great things about this game. Um, okay, the sounds you make can alert God, so you must learn to move quietly. Your footsteps are louder when you run and when you cross over loud floor surfaces such as metal. Walk slowly and quietly over this metal surface without alerting the nearby guard. You can creep quietly by holding down Zdrl. That's control, I know. I'm just being silly again, I'm sorry. We're having fun, don't we? There's a guard. There's the metal floor. And here am I. To do, to do. Let's go in. The inn. All missions have objectives, even this training mission. Your first objective is to break into the inn. You can complete the objective by entering through this delivery hatch. Press C to crouch, then walk through the hatch. When you are inside, press C again to stand up. And yes, I will read out loud everything. Even I'm not really that 
good at that. But I need the practice. And if you don't want to hear it, you can skip it. Now what? There's a barrel in my way! Hmm. My first obstacle. Let's think outside the box. You can use some objects by positioning them in the, uh, in the center of the screen. When they highlight, press R mouse to use them. Use this door to open it and proceed into the next room. Yeah. Alright, let's use the door. Quite simple tasks so far. Use your bow and water arrow to extinguish that torch on the wall. When guards are nearby, putting out torches creates darkness. And darkness is our friend. That you can sneak through. First select the water arrow by pressing 8. Then pull and hold left mouse button to aim and release it to fire. But yeah. Extinguish this torch to proceed. Press 8. Check. See again. Stand up. I want to look the torch in the eye when I kill it. Bam! You're dead. Take that torch. Ha ha ha! Victorious. I'm victorious. There's another water arrow for me to equip. That is very. Hmm. That is. That is really... Hmm. That is... Hmm. That... That's... Really... Nice. I like this spot. Hmm. One, one more. One more. Come on. There's still some... Oh no. No, I'm, I'm, I'm full. I'm full. Can't take any more. I, I, I can't. But those are shiny. Now I can keep them. But I want them. One more. One. One for the way. Thanks. Okay. Uh, I shouldn't. Okay. The last. The, the last. Okay. Uh, sneaky. 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 I'm sneaky again. Stealth mode. To climb on top of obstacles, get close to them and press space. Climb over these boxes to proceed. Okay. <laughs> Training successful. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Don't overreact, Garrett. Calm down. Relax. You're the best. We know. 